How's everybody doing today? This is DJ with One Time Outdoors. And this video has taken way longer than it should have. I've shot this video at least four different times. So this will be number five and I'm still very impressed with this knife. This knife is um, sold by Holtzman's Gorilla Survival. They have you know a bunch of different products. Let's show you what I'm talking about. Let me bring the camera down so you can see. So in the box you'll get some paperwork telling you, you know, how to take care of the knife, how to clean the knife, how to store the knife. I believe it even tells you how to sharpen the knife. You also get that. Okay. So you get, you know, your thank you card. Anything you buy from this company, you will get a thank you card, which is a nice little touch. And then also, if you sign up, you'll get a free gift. Um... You know, it'd be nice if they would include a sticker. You know, who doesn't like stickers nowadays? But not a biggie. You also get your little gel packet. And then... You get this bad boy. I did, uh, you know, put a little bit of... Uh, What did I use? Sorry about that. I had a brain fart. So, I do use frog lube. To keep my blades, uh, you know, in great shape. Um, and that's also food safe. So here's a good look at the knife. It is 1095 high carbon steel, G10 handles and liners, and I have to say I am very impressed with the fit and finish on this knife. It's hard to tell, but I mean the plunge lines are even. You know, I've got I've gotten extremely high dollar expensive knives where this right here is crooked or you know more on one side than the other and if you're wondering this knife cost just over a hundred dollars now you get the knife you get a kydex sheath which is, you know, pretty thick kydex. Has your little drain hole. Well, it's actually a pretty big drain hole. Uh, you get a ferro rod loop. Or holder, sorry. You also get this uh, piece of leather for, you know, to... You know, extra... 
you know, like a retention or redundancy lock, if you will. So, um, okay, so there's this, and then you get a very nice G10 black G10 with orange liners you know steel scraper that fits into your sheath and then it comes with this ferro rod which is black G10 and orange liners so you know everything matches very nicely sorry I'm trying to look through the phone and make this video and you know it's pretty difficult looking through it but everything matches very nicely um, you know here's here's how this would go and even without this of the camera it's very secure yeah it rattles a little bit not much you know I I have you know some very expensive sheaths and you can definitely see the quality difference and you know things like that the fit and finish the attention to detail you know but you get all this for a hundred dollars so it's it's not bad and it's a great starter knife I think um, this does go in here um, I it suggested in the other video to take a piece of sandpaper or a file and just make this a little bigger so this slides in easier and I'll show you what I mean in another video when I sand this out um, the guy that owns this company is a very good guy. Um, you know, he seems like he really cares about his customers and everything like that. He wants your feedback and your input and your suggestions. And I, you know, I like that. Um, so let me... just check my notes um, okay so the knife everything the knife the sheath the attachments weighs 14.74 ounces the knife itself weighs 8.8 18 ounces or 235 grams now this knife feels really good in the hand you know the jimping is not too aggressive um, I really like how it's got these uh, finger scallops you know so you can you know you can hold it in you know different positions you know you got your pinch grip if you want you know it's got a, a pretty decent palm swell it's a very comfortable knife. The only thing I don't like about this knife is the hollow grind. Uh, especially being, you know, it's marketed as a woods knife or a bushcraft knife. And I just, I don't like the fact that it's a hollow grind. Um, like I said, it's 1095. Um... It also comes with 40 inches of paracord so you can if you don't want to put your you know your striker on the sheath you can use it as a necklace or make a necklace um, it is full tank construction you can see the you know it's one solid piece of steel the overall of the knife is 8.6 inches with a 4 inch blade and the thickness of the blade is 1 eighth the 
the widest point of the blade is one and three eighths. Now the handle, like I mentioned, is black and orange G10. The handle at its widest point is one and one eighth. The handle thickness at its thickest point is seven eighth, seven eighths. Um, I believe the knife is ninety nine dollars and ninety five cents with free prime shipping. I got this knife next day. Um, Now, it does advertise that it comes with a tech lock. This is not a tech lock. Um, I do like this lock better than a tech lock. But I also seen on the website that it said an upgraded model. So I'm, maybe he has two different models and the newer sheets have the tech lock. So, you know, that's that. Um, yeah, I mean, honestly, I think for the $100 you pay, this is a great knife. And he's always having sales and, you know, different things going on. I will show you some of his other items he has. I have, so far, I think I have all of the ferro rods he makes. He makes, you know, quality uh, ferro rods. Oh, by the way, the, the knife and everything is made in China, but it ships from the U.S., so it's not like you'll wait, you know, forever for it. Um, here's the newest ferro rod I got, which is a wood handle. Um, it also has, you know, a lanyard, sorry, so you can, oh, I didn't even realize that. This is actually a ferro rod too. And you can attach your, you know, striker to it. Uh, I did talk to him and he's working on selling these strikers individually which I really like. These are great strikers. Um, this also has the quick release. You know, I know some people are funny about, you know, putting things around their neck. And if you want to add, uh, you know, your striker to it or your ferro rod, all you have to do is just cut one of the ends, slide it, take this off, slide that through, and then reburn the end and it'll be good to go. Um, this also comes with a nice leather holster, holster, however you say that. So, you know, that's really nice. Now this, this is the first time I put it in the holster. I just opened this up today. Very nice stitching. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, this will fit in here as well. So, um, and here's another ferro rod I have. He sells these too. And if you wanted, you know, you could put the orange one in there. So I, I love his, you know, his products. Um, I think they're a great value, uh, especially his ferro rods. You, you can't go wrong with his ferro rods, and that, I promise you. Um, you know, I've been using the knife on and off for almost a month now, and you can see <laughs> it's in perfect shape. The last time I used it, I was actually uh, filleting chicken, and I will... 
try and add some pictures of me doing that in here. Um, so I'm going to sh just real quick show you some of his uh, other items he has on Amazon. You know, and of, as of right now, he has... Here, let me adjust the camera so I don't have to hold it. Oops, sorry about that. So, right now he has this knife, which is almost the same exact size of... You know, this knife I just showed you. But if you look up here, it has a little different grind. Unfortunately, I do believe it is hollow grind. But it's D2 steel. And that comes with everything I've showed you. But just with this color right here. Uh, if you see back here, you know, it comes with the Allen wrench. Uh, you know, your paracord your scraper just everything's in this pattern um, and it's the same exact price which is you know pretty cool uh, he also has a Facebook group um, you know pretty active and I highly recommend joining the group because, you know, there's a lot of people telling, talking about very good information. So, you know, it, it's always a plus. Um, you know, here's a really nice uh, lanyard keychain or paracord keychain. And if you can see, you know, everything's really good at price. You know, you got the D2 steel knife, $99.95. The knife that I have, $99.95. Um, a a six-inch ferro rod, $17. You know, with a wooden handle and scraper. Here's the one I just showed you, $14.96. With a leather sheath. I mean, come on now. Where are you going to get something with that quality for that price. Here's another, you know, really nice uh, keychain type paracord lanyard, um, but it also has a ferro rod, a flashlight, a whistle, I think, you know. So you can go to Amazon and, you know, find a bunch of his gear. Again, I will show you. Here is his information. I'm going to pause it so that way you can. Or you can pause it so that way you can write down the information. <laughs> but, yes, I highly recommend, you know his his gear um i'm not going to do knife things with the knife unfortunately today i already did multiple videos of it that i'm going to add to this video or it'll be in another video so again thank you for watching please like share and subscribe definitely go check out Holtzman's Gorilla Survival on Amazon. I truly believe you'll be impressed. Have a blessed day. Please like, share, and subscribe.